Good morning, happy Friday. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Lynn if you're new here. It is currently 6.57 a.m. I'm about to head down to my gym in my building to go work out. I'm currently doing Olivia Poling's hot, healthy girl guide, something like that. I'm on the second week of workouts. Um, kind of just doing them like as I go to the gym because I jump between training in the gym and running and sometimes also doing workout classes so we're gonna go to workout six i wanted to do it earlier this week but the ebook wasn't loading in the gym the service isn't the best there but we're gonna go work out i'm in the sports bra from um forever 21 like a million years ago i'm wearing my lemon invigorates and my nike my contours which i absolutely love and this is my new hair, which you would have already seen. I was gonna vlog last night. I went to an event, an event at Sweat & Tonic. Their new tonic bar um, is open Monday through Friday, 5.30 p.m. till 9 p.m., I believe, if I'm remembering. It opens today, um, but it's on an event last night. I took Corey, it was so much fun. They have really cool drinks. They're like, it's like collagen in one of the mocktail, mocktails, they were cocktails. Um, and like different, and have coconut water, like it was cool, but we're gonna go work out. Unfortunately, I do not feel comfortable taking you guys with me to the gym. Um, just not, just not there yet. Um, let's go work out and update on how I'm liking my AirPod Pros. I like them so much more than the regular ones. If you can afford to get your hands on these ones, highly, highly recommend. I love the transparency for when I'm running and when I'm on walks or when I'm recording my podcast. And I like the sound blocking if I'm trying to focus on work. Um, love it. Let's. Let's go and work out. We just got done at the gym. Excuse my mask. I'm gonna go on a walk. Just grabbing a sweater. And let's head out. I like to change my shoes because I don't like to wear my gym shoes outside, preferably. So let's go walk and I will chat after. Hello, I just got out of the shower. Um, I washed my face. And then I've been using this Bridal Glow Brightening Serum to help with the scars from my breakouts. And then just this Purse Day Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. It's actually massive and I like have barely made a dent in it. Like I'm gonna have this forever. Um, and then I'm just gonna put on a little Super Goop Glow Screen. I'm almost out of this. I'm supposed to be receiving a package from them, which is super exciting, which is why I've been holding off buying because if I'm gonna be sent, like, I'm not gonna go and buy more because then I'm just gonna have too much product at home. Also, I have all these sunspots on my shoulders and back. I'm not sure why. I hope that, like, next summer they don't turn like brown spots like i really don't want that i don't think it's cute i just need to touch up my mascara i've been using this one from say it's a clean beauty brand and i really like it the brush i love like plastic ones like this and i find it doesn't smudge i was having an issue with the beauty counter one like smudging and then um the not the first day beauty the um a cosmetics one like like flaking um because of the formula so then i'd have like little black specks like all over my face but this one i really like and then i've been really liking the merit beauty brow gel i just brush my brows up like so like it was really hard to do just brush them up. I've been living in these sweats again. They're from LPA. Um, they're by LPA from Revolve. I really like them. I bought the Mega Sweat, the Mega Sweats from 
Aritzia, but like I bought them off Facebook Marketplace and I got them in a medium and they're just, they're massive. I don't know what to do with them. I could try sell them. Um, like they're brand new with tags, but like they're really big. Like they're too long on me. Like they're just, I'm not tall enough for the medium. We're just gonna touch up the hair and then go sit down and do some work. I went to Farm Boy um, on my walk to just get some blueberries because I finished all my berries yesterday and I've been, I have like my last quarter of an avocado left and they had um, avocados on special for four for five dollars and normally like it's like two for five dollars and they're all like super unripe so they'll last a while i always buy unripe avocados sometimes i try to like score one that is nearing ripening but i just keep one out like on the counter for waiting on our fruit bowl um to ripen faster and then i keep the ones that i'm not ready to have yet in the fridge so that they stay unripe longer and then when i need them to be ripe i take them out little light pack and then whenever i use an avocado i keep the part that i don't use like with the pit and tin foil in the fridge i am actually so in love with my hair color I'm so happy. I was scared that I'd regret it. I wouldn't like it, but I'm a very happy camper. I've been into curling my hair with the flat iron again. I think I'm gonna need a new flat iron soon because it's starting to cut, like pull on my hair a lot. And I think I'm gonna get, I'd like to get the GHG one. I'm gonna ask the girl who dyed my hair what flat iron she recommends. Um, but I know she's a fan of like the GHG products. I normally buy flat irons from Winners. Do you see how it's like getting caught? Like, it's really hard for me to do it smoothly. She's getting old. I've had this since high school. Oh, and I also got a coffee from Pilot Roasters. Their um, flat white is like $3.95, which is awesome. And then I think it's like 50 or 75 cents to change it to almond milk. To feel like everywhere else, like a flat white is so much more. So theirs is like a true flat white. I feel like this is super chatty. Let me know if you like more chatty style vlogs or like more montagey or if you like a good mix of both i'm definitely like i feel like a good mix of both is always good maybe i just need to wipe the flat iron down i don't know maybe there's like product build up but i've also had this for a really long time yesterday was a very emotional day i felt like really overwhelmed i spoke about it a little bit on my podcast episode that went out on monday of this week that you're watching this video um if you're watching this when it goes live and thank god i had therapy yesterday because it definitely helped a lot and like talking to your loved ones always helps Okay, this clip is really long, I'm gonna end it here. Leanna's being a housewife. I just For told herself. Atlanta how much I love being in the kitchen. It I mean, brings like, me much joy. <laughs> I mean, like, look at this. She is a spread. 
We love it. We stand a, a baking, cooking queen. I wouldn't say this is baking. This is definitely cooking, okay. salad prepping. Yes. Like, look at that precision. She, you know, she's chef supreme. <laughs> <laughs> she could go on, um, yeah. is Find it Top out, Chef? <laughs> Top Chef Canada oh, or something? Yes. People are probably like, she's gonna cut her fingers off. <laughs> she's doing it wrong. Yeah, you're supposed to like hold it like this. You know what, Lana? I don't know how. You know what, Lana? I'm the chef supreme. So. <laughs> Look at it. And in the stunning queen bowls because yeah. we gotta make a reel. Yeah, we're making a reel over here, you know? Leanne's essentially my bitch. <laughs> Working on my campaigns. Leanne and I are going on our walks together. I feel like we always go separate, but we're, we decide to go together. Two months of living together, and it gave us two months to decide to be efficient and have company. Yes. <laughs> and Leanne's going to LCBO. <laughs> we're gonna go to Loblaws because we're making Gigi Hadid. Don't really love her, but we're making her pasta recipe tonight. So, I hate how I always say, I'm about to say that's what's up, but that's what's up. Let's do a little haul. We're back from the grocery store. We got two bags of brown rice fuzili. We got some whipping cream because in Canada we don't have heavy cream, which I feel like I should have known. We got a sweet onion, ignore my plastic. And we got tomato paste. And that's our little haul. And we're making Gigi Hadid's pasta tonight. Pasta, pasta. I don't know why I keep saying it's so weird, but I don't care. And we're gonna watch you in a hot set. So, not like the show you, not you. And Leanne got some fun coolers <laughs> and beer and such. This is obviously how chefs dress in the kitchen. So, you know, quite a bit dressed. It's Cory Cam. Want to have a little Cory Cam action? What? Cam. It's Cory Cam. I'm trying to show my fit, but my shirt's not going on. Okay, here's the fit. Seven dollars short from H and M. Babaton contour bodysuit. Molina pants, long and like a brown color. Bag shoes not included. Bad bitch energy is though. Hungry, hungry bitch energy is. Let me show you my nudes. Look at my nudes. I've said Gia, brown rice nudes. You gotta do that? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Not surprised. Can you dump that out on the weekly vlogs? The vlogs in DTTO. Week in my life living in downtown Toronto as a 21st city gal. This is how much we spend in a week in DTTO. I have a latte. And the latte must cost $8 or more. So much work I need to do today. So much. So, I have so many. So many emails. <laughs> very, very difficult it's a life. Day in the life. Up at Toronto TO gal, 22 years to old. Get my nails done. Definitely, we're going to get a lymphatic drainage massage. Yes. We have a reservation. Reservation <laughs> at um, STK Steakhouse, but yeah. only for vegan food, obviously. Of course, of course. Veganism is life. <laughs> Hope y'all enjoy that. ready to go to the gym it is 9 20 ish i'm going to go and do an up i think it's an upper body workout um it's just from olivia polling's guide it's super gloomy outside it says it's raining it doesn't look like it's raining um but i'm gonna go work out and then i have an appointment at 2 30 and it's gonna take me like an hour to get there by commuting and uber is like 30 dollars. i'm just like i don't feel like spending 30 dollars on that so i'm gonna commute there it's like an appointment I don't have to go to often. Um, 
commute there, commute back. Um, my appointment's at 2.30, but I just want to lay low today. I want to get some schoolwork done, um, maybe film some content for brand deals, but just like take a nice easy day. Tomorrow will be my cleaning day. So yeah, I'm wearing my Lululemon Invigorates, the Energy Longline bra and like I think it's rosemary green. And I'm gonna put my Metcon 4s on, but that's just the work outfit. Oh, and I think I'm gonna go put, pick up these um, marble coasters um, that I found on Facebook Marketplace for like 15 bucks and like they're only like 30 for a set of four. So that's what we're gonna do. And I will chat to you guys when I'm back my workout i went for a walk the lighting is on it i went for a walk i got a coffee i got an oat flat white from nava social now we made a smoothie i think i'm back on my smoothie kick i think i'm gonna post a story of me pouring into the cup this is just a berry smoothie i made it earlier this week I really do like it. The only thing I hate about using the Vitamix is that it's like a mish and a half to clean. But she does blend the smoothies really well. This smoothie is just banana, frozen mixed berries, maca, almond butter, um, new new fix. Um, it's this protein. It's actually by my friend Amanda. New fix. It's this um, pea protein um, vanilla. Um, I'll have a link in my in the show notes. In the show notes. What am I saying? We're not on a podcast over here. In the description, um, it will give you I think ten percent off or fifteen percent off. I think I actually like it more than New Zest. They're both like my top two, and but like obviously gonna support my friend. Amanda. So banana, frozen berries, maca, almond butter, collagen. I also have been using this like gut FX thing. It has a glutamine, marshmallow root, aloe vera, leaf gel, slippery elm, and then um, it has N-acetyl glucosamine. I don't know what that is. And then also probiotics. Because normally I take slippery elm and then I was taking L glutamine before I moved out, but I haven't been and like I just know when my gut health is like diminishing. So we're we're implementing that back into the routine, but that's what's in the smoothie. Super, super delish. It's around 12:17. Definitely like a later start to the day. I have to leave at around like 1:30-ish to go to my appointment in North York. It's gonna take like an hour to get there on transit. Um, I'm gonna sit and watch some YouTube or Netflix and have my smoothie and then I will shower Maybe clean a little. I don't know what time it will be Shower and then change and head out and yeah, that's what's up. I need to get this nail fixed my It's not gonna focus my middle finger nail is like breaking So I think I need to one get it glued and like to get my nails cut super short I think I want to do like a dark color that's what's up with my life right now and i'm obsessed with my hair i'm very happy very happy with the hair i hope you are enjoying this vlog let me know what other content you would like to see i feel like my apartment's finally coming together let me know if you'd like an apartment tour somewhat soon but i'm so happy the sun is coming out it was supposed to be raining all day today but it is not it was only spitting and the sun is coming out so let's hope Cross fingers crossed that it stays like this but I hope you're enjoying the vlog and I will chat to you in a little bit. I hate how I always do this, but maybe I'll break the habit. So I got ready. I didn't end up watching any TV, um, but I'm about to head out my hour long commute. Um, I'll listen to a podcast. Just grabbing my running shoes and gonna put them on. Literally have to take I've never been on line four before and I have to take a line four on the subway. There's a first for everything. I want to get more of these, like another pack of these crew socks from Maritzia because I really like them and I think oh, my shoes need to be cleaned. I think they're going to come clutch 
in the winter. Zara jeans, Aritzia hoodie, and Nike Air Force Ones. Chat soon. Good morning, happy Sunday. My sheets are currently on the in the wash. I cleaned the entire kitchen last night. I had a night in. We watched like eight, se eight seasons, eight episodes of You. I am about to go on a run. This is the fit. They're my Wonder Trains in Cases. Free to be elevated bra in white, both Lulu. And then I really wanna wear my Nike zoom invincibles again but i'm trying to like rotate through my shoes so i don't wear them out super fast so i'll probably wear my infinity reacts my white ones which really need to be washed and yeah that's what we're up to i'm having a pretty chill day oh my nail i had to cut it because it was so sore i had a band-aid on it i'm gonna try to get them those done today I'm going to make a pa ow. Um, a pasta dish for sister giving tonight. I'm thinking a pesto. We have like this pesto. So okay. Yeah. So I can use this one or have this one. And um, this one's vegan, this one's not. So we shall see. Yeah, they're both not free, which is great because I don't want to burn something with nuts. But yeah, that is what we're up to. Pretty chill day, and I hope that you are enjoying the vlog. I need to also work on my assignment that's due tomorrow, finalize things. It's a group project. Um, look at my notes for my midterm on Friday. Gotta start like getting on top of that and let's go run it's kind of chilly out so i think i might have to throw like a long sleeve over top of this but overall this is this is the fit i'll probably wear like my swiftly my swiftly long sleeve swiftly tech long sleeve shirt in black and then like tuck it in here hello i went for my run i hit my fastest pace this zootropic drink like my pace was 454 give or take like had to stop at some light so it wasn't like consistently running but i ran 5.5k in 27 minutes my pace was 454 kilometer 454 per kilometer um not miles i don't know what that is in miles maybe like low sevens high sixes somewhere around that of course i'm back in these sweats what else is new of course i'm in my line tank what else is new i've been filming an asmr um tiktok for a brand deal making oats haven't had oats all week been having smoothies um, thought it would be good to have post run, especially because it's like one o'clock. Need some food. Let me put you on my tripod. Yeah, we're actually, you heard it here first. We're using the tripod. Oh, I put my gut powder in here and it doesn't taste too hot. So I just did oats, some protein powder, the new fix one, um, vanilla and vanilla. And I'm gonna add cinnamon. I haven't put cinnamon in my oats for a hot sec. These bowls are fable and I love them. I believe I have a code so I'll put it in the description. Some blueberries. I'm gonna cut a banana. Oh she's really right. I like never put the last little bit of the banana away. I always just eat it. Yeah, my coffee doesn't look too hot. Oh, my battery's gonna die. Okay, I will chat to you guys after. She's trying. Hello, it is now Sunday evening. I went and got my nails done. I went to this place called Minicures. It's a bit more bougie. Definitely not an everyday encounter. We got um, a tip put on with dipping powder on this finger so we have even nails again i got this beautiful chocolate brown we we definitely are into brown um and then i stopped at farm boy 
and I got some bananas. I've been craving broccoli, so I got some broccoli. And then we finished my lettuce, so I got some lettuce. Um, and I think I'm gonna put some soup on. I've been very much into soup. I got like this mushroom and kale one from Farm Boy. Didn't really like it. Picked up some butternut from Fresh and Wild. So I'm gonna put that on, and then I'm gonna also have a slice of sourdough toast with butter with it and watching you finishing that up and i'm not going to sister giving i thought it was at seven it was at five and my team worker or teammate co-worker no teammate group member didn't do his part for his assignment so now i'm gonna be <laughs> doing it um or at least attempting to because i don't want to leave it he's like i can only do it tomorrow when like we said like friday we love people um so i'm gonna warm this up on the stove and then my sheets are still drying and then i'm gonna have to make my bed fold my laundry all these things um we're about to have an evening it's around i don't know what time it is it's 5 46 wow beautiful angle but i'm i'm really happy with my nails i don't know what color it is it's by opi got our pot handy dandy toaster i'm obsessed with butternut squash soup she's thick highly recommend this sourdough This is the mushroom and kale soup that I got from Farm Boy. It's okay. I'll still finish it, but she's toasted perfectly. Yes, I'm using the bowl piece, but I'm not gonna do a separate plate. This is just the Le Grand vegan butter. Comment below what your favorite bread is and what your favorite soup is i also love split pea soup and lentil soup i really like this butter and then what i like to do is for some added protein we add some hemp hearts And then of course some black pepper and voila. Quick and easy soup and toast, so delicious. Mm -hmm. 